Hello everyone and welcome to the back lot at 50. Uh, so on this one I'm using Survivors of Rick uh, with the Crescent's Edge, Beta with his Morningstar and Hilltop Maggie with the uh, Fire Cripple weapon. Um, we need to open boxes um, but we also need to kill a tank uh, hence why I've taken some with fire. I'm hoping to be able to get Beta charged up through the Perseverance trait uh, by keeping this one stunned and uh, hoping to be able to ch pass some charge points around um, relatively soon. Um, don't want to create frap, so Haggy will be staying in overwatch when she's not charged. I uh, didn't get the uh, charge point there, which is annoying. Um, so we are going to move Haggy back and bring Rick down so that he is in overwatch. And we're gonna to have to bring Beta back as well. Uh, so the fire cripple pistol should, oh, it was already crippled, wasn't he? That's annoying. Uh, I'm gonna try and herd something here. Cause uh, there seems to be some sort of bug with the mask where if you use it, you can sometimes gain the charge point um which just happened there so now i'm going to hit these with beta uh should stun them all or at least and hopefully kill ha <laughs> well that's fr annoying um let's hit them again because i'm one space away from the tank I need one charge point, uh, which hopefully means that Haggy will cripple it and it won't attack. Excellent. Now we're going to use Rick to hit these two because we got guaranteed swift strike. I knew I was going to kill that one and then I can move out of the way. And I'm going to save beat his charge attack for now. Uh, that was going to be a one, two, so I need to be at least here. Uh, so I want to stay out the way of these two, but I kind of also want to stay within range of the tank so I can get an overwatch attack on it. So that'll do it. And... Let's go and hit these. So that's going to stun the top one and push the other ones away. And got Haggy charged again. So I can use her charge attack. I'm going to use it on that one. And again, I'm going to be one space away so I can go and hit that one. And make sure Haggy's in range of the tank, which burnt out anyway. And we've got Beta charged up now. So let's go and start opening boxes. We found one. Um, I'm going to leave this one till last. And let's open that one. Open that one. And done. Okay, so it's this one up here, which is good. And let's... Oh, we're going to open it with... I've got another turn, so I'm going to open it with Rick in a second. And I'm going to go and stun these with Beta. And let's cripple that one for now. As we can, and cripple them both. And then we can just get to the line. So 
that's how I've uh, I've done that one. I uh, hope you find it useful, uh, particularly a little trick with the uh, herd uh, mask and gaining a charm point. Not sure if it works without beta in lead or, um, or having to use beta. I've heard reports that it does uh, work without him, so maybe worth a try if you haven't got Magic Cat yet, uh, which I don't, um, but will very much like when I do. Um, I hope you find it useful, and I'll see you on another video. Thanks for watching.